Good morning, folks. Ultra short show today. We are just going to be eyeing the sun and the earth. Science articles are usually few and far between the last two weeks of the year, but the sun is trying to make up for it. We're at spaceweathernews.com, and we'll begin with the last 24 hours on our star, which has brought two more M-class solar flares. Not much in the way of ejected plasma from them, but a continuation of the sunspot bonanza on our star. Yesterday, we had focused on the south-central eruption and the apparent coronal push and forecasted Earth-directed CME. Soho and Stereo captured the plasma cloud. It is faint, but it's there. And we definitely do have a weak CME on its way to Earth here, and the endless spirals are on point, with both showing impact in the latter half of the day on the 23rd. Up next, it will be the X-ray flux, where you see the solar flare spikes, including the two impulsive events the last few hours the last of which did come from an active region cresting the limb, so it does look like it's going to be eyes on the sun for a number of days in a row here. We greatly appreciate your support. We have all the old school wind maps this morning, eyes on our star today. Subscribe and we'll do this all again tomorrow, right here, but right now at 6 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open, no fear. Be safe, everyone.